Good evening. Something's in the water at a hotel in Calcasieu Parish that has hotel managers worried for their guests and their business. KPLC's Jaron Jordan is standing by with the details. That's right, Cynthia. Well, it's nothing new that water pipes get old and need to be frequently maintained. But what happens when it starts affecting businesses that depend on your customer satisfaction to succeed? That's the question the Calcasieu Parish Hotel is dealing with tonight. The, the water was yellow, and then I took a shower, and I was like, what? This is what the bathtub in Timothy Kinnemer's room at the Red Roof Inn on Highway 397 in Calcasieu Parish looked like after he ran water for a shower. That's not residue from body dirt. Something's in the water. I've stayed at bad hotels before. I'm not saying it's a bad hotel, but come on, man. And for the most part, it's not a bad hotel. According to TripAdvisor.com, it's the second-rated hotel in the lake area. That's why manager Parul Patel fears the dirty water she and guests have had to endure for more than a week now will hurt her business. I worked so hard for it to get that number on a website. And it, because of this issue, if I'm going to drop down, who's going to be responsible for it? Now, when you turn on the faucet, it appears like the water is running clear. But if you let that water run and collect for a few minutes, all you're left with is this, a cup that looks more like a cup of lemonade than a cup of water. Now, Patel says that since the problem is affecting all of the rooms in the hotel, including right here in the laundry room, it's cost her thousands of dollars in damages. The linens and the bath towels and all kind of stuff, already we have at least uh, like a few thousand dollars damage. And it's not just the Red Roof Inn having problems. Nearby businesses have also noticed differences in their water supply. The area is managed by the Calcasieu Parish Department of Public Works and falls in Water District No. 5's jurisdiction. According to the Department of Health and Hospitals, 3,900 people depend on water from this district. Alan Wainwright, Director of Public Works, issued this statement to KPLC, saying in part, quote, The district is aware that some customers are currently experiencing problems with discolored water, which is a associated with the oxidation of natural iron particles found in drinking water. A project has been initiated to replace water filter components that are used to remove iron from the drinking water supply, which should remedy the discoloration issue." End quote. Now also in that statement, Wainwright said that water is safe to consume by the standards set by the Department of Health and Hospitals. As for Patel, she says that she's already had to give nearly a dozen refunds to unhappy customers and says their corporate offices have received a number of complaints. She, of course, hopes the water is cleared up soon. At your service, Jaron Jordan, KPLC 7 News.